Jeff Hardy will be backstage at tonight's AEW Dynamite and is expected to sign with the company on a multi-year deal that will see him work once again with names such as Daniel Bryan, CM Punk and of course his brother Matt. Where Jeff Hardy goes from here is anyone's guess. The booking has apparently not been planned yet, but it sure sounds as though the WWE have really let one go here. Hello everyone, my name is Tom Collihue, and on January 28th, nearly a month and a half ago, I first reported on Twitter that AEW will be signing Jeff Hardy. Now, officially, Jeff Hardy was not legally able to be signed until today, or during tonight's Dynamite. The main reason for that is due to a non-compete clause with the WWE that he had, which lasted 90 days since his release, or his firing as it actually was. The reasons for his firing, of course, was that Jeff Hardy, apparently, according to the WWE, was wrestling under the influence and was unable to complete the required wrestling that the WWE saw fit. The instruction was that he would go to rehab or he would lose his job. Jeff Hardy, meanwhile, as has been confirmed in Twitch streams by his brother Matt, was not willing to do that on the basis that he did not require rehab, he was not working under the influence in any way, shape or form. I have spent a long time, essentially since the firing, digging into those WWE archives trying to find a way that I can see anything to prove that Jeff Hardy was under the influence, I have found absolutely nothing. So when Jeff Hardy says to a Twitch audience that there is no working under the influence, I thoroughly believe him. Now Jeff Hardy is potentially under a little bit of a, a little bit of trouble already in AEW, primarily because he openly said uh, in an interview on YouTube with a, a, a lesser known podcaster, shall we say, that he would be joining AEW. Now that interviewer did post that video and Jeff Hardy did have to recant that statement saying that he was excited to be working with AEW but had not signed anything yet. Of course if he had signed something that would have been a massive breach of his contract which despite being fired 90 days previous did last fully through until today. The WWE's plan of course when it comes to AEW is to essentially starve them out, force them to spend more money than they have in order to essentially guarantee that the WWE with their turnover and their profit would be able to put them out of business. That is the WWE's plan at the moment. From what I can tell, essentially since Matt Hardy himself left the WWE, Jeff Hardy has had interest from AEW. All Elite Wrestling's management are very excited to get hold of Jeff Hardy and be able to use him in their programming going forwards. I'm not aware of any continued issues with Jeff Hardy and CM Punk, although to be fair, uh, issues with CM Punk is something that has gone through quite a few different people in the AW locker room and he seems to have landed pretty firmly on his feet regardless when it comes to Punk. Jeff Hardy, however, for at least a little while, is expected to team with his brother and work in the same sort of dream match scenario as CM Punk himself, Daniel Bryan and others have been working in. I would not necessarily expect Jeff Hardy to be chasing championships, but more to work in the same realm as Christian has worked since arriving at the W, sorry, since arriving at AEW more than a year ago, elevating other talent, putting on some interesting matches, working in multi-man matches and being a star attraction. Christian has provided that, Jeff Hardy will be doing so as well. If this is the sort of news that you're really enjoying, finding out that Jeff Hardy will be at AEW Dynamite and is expected to sign a contract, and you'd like to hear it before these videos go live, please make sure to like this video and subscribe. We do live shows uh, three times a week, at least, in which we cover a lot of spoiler warning topics. This news about Jeff Hardy is something, as I say, I first mentioned in January, back in January 28th, so almost a month and a half ago. In the meantime, I hope everyone is excited for tonight's AW Dynamite, especially given that Jeff Hardy is going to be there. We will wait and see if he actually appears during the show, but I can say for certain he will be backstage. The contract is on offer and expecting to be signed. Thank you, everyone. I've been Tom Collihue. Good night.